so 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 i participated in this two week dance workout it's is it korean i think it's a korean dance workout routine and the entire video is actually three minutes long Hi guys you're welcome back again to my channel my name is yabby's own i'm actually thinking of rebranding my channel i have a channel name in mind but let's see how it goes so the main challenge is to do it 30 minutes a day for two weeks and you're going to see a weight loss of 20 pounds equivalent to 10 kilograms at the end of the two weeks now the thing is i've really been wanting to do such a challenge but my challenge also was that i don't have a tape measure and i don't have a scale and it was taking longer time for me to get access to those and i didn't want those to hinder my progress because i wanted like to take measurements where people would see before and after and then they can do all their comparison and again as i'm waiting for it it's taking long and then i'm like okay whatever let's just get right on to it whether there's a tape measure whether there's a scale let me just do it it's for my own well-being as well so i took up the challenge and it was quite an interesting experience the first day was good i learned how to do the dance yeah it, it was like i learned how to do the dance on the first day the second day as well and it was going so it was going quite well but it was really really exhausting <laughs> it was so 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 exhausting at a point like i was running out of breath when i initially started i was running out of breath i had to take some pauses and all that stuff but now on the, after i did it on the first day it was normal On the second day, I started feeling pain, slight pain in my legs, like my calves and my, yeah, my calves basically around my ankle as well. And then I had some pain in my waist, like my the side of my body, so around my ribs. <laughs> and so that was, I felt that pain on the second day, but I was like, oh, it's part of exercise. You know, when you start exercising or you start a new exercise routine, you feel all those pains. So it's really normal because your body's also adjusting to the whole process of exercising so i did exercise again on the second day and on the third day on the third day i was as if someone had beaten me oh me or me carrying my own body i say i want to do exercise because i'm forming and the thing is i'm i'm very happy with the way my body is looking i actually don't mind gaining some weight like i'm very confident and happy in my skin but i just wanted to lose some weight in some areas like my tummy because ever since i was born i've never had a flat tummy like i can't come and kill myself with flat tummy my okay tummy has been a certain size ever since i can't remember ever since i was born i remember when i was even much younger and even before puberty i used to think i was pregnant you know i didn't even know how you can fall pregnant but i knew pregnant women had big tummy so i was like am i pregnant <laughs> like my tummy has always been big but i like my weight my weight is good like i just like how i'm look i'm looking at the mirror right now i just ha i just like how i look in the mirror i'm pretty confident in my skin but i just wanted to lose some fat around my tummy and my waist and also the nature of my job is such that i sit down a lot like is it was a regular nine to five there's a lot of sitting down and very less physical activity and so i did the exercise and on the third day geez this is how i was moving i couldn't even turn in my bed though you see how it's nice when you're sleeping and then it's around dawnish and that that part of the day when the sleep becomes very nice and then you just want to turn and you know change the gear jesus christ i couldn't i couldn't do that like when i move <clears throat> my ribs this side of my wrist paining me and when i i mean when i get up and i'm sitting down jesus even to get out of my bed was a problem like i was in pain baby girl was in pain and thankfully it was a sunday and i wasn't going to work i wasn't going anywhere so it was a very tough day for me i couldn't even lift my hand i couldn't like it was a very 
like that day, I didn't even speak to anybody in this house. I was just walking like an old woman. <laughs> it was very, it was quite an experience I haven't really had in a long time. I think it was because we were working part of our, of the muscles we hardly worked out for me, I'd say, because we used to do some stretches, like I'm going to show a clip of it. So you know that, so you stretch all that way and then, so I think I was putting a lot of weight and stretching my muscles and my muscles were getting used to it all and my legs were paining me, jeez. So on the third day, sis, I took a break, okay, I took a break, I didn't do any workout on the third day. I really wanted to pull through like without any breaks but the spirit was willing but the flesh said, no girl, we ain't doing it today. <laughs> but. Aside that, and one thing about it is that I didn't also want to take another extra day. And once that happens, you become you begin to be lazy, really. It's very easy. Be like, okay, well, okay, I didn't do it yesterday. So if I don't do it today, that's a matter. Let me just do it. You know, you become lazy. So I tried and tried it, and I fell. I was I, I was able to follow through with the rest of the days, and then I did an additional day for the third day that I missed. So in total, it was a 15-day record. At a point I had mastered the song, I can't even close my eyes and do the routine. Like I can do it, I can I could do the routine of head. And mind you, in this footage, I won't be showing you every single day of the routine because it's just monotonous and boring. And I was doing it indoors, I was doing it in the living room. <laughs> I'm sure I was giving my roommate <laughs> quite a tough time because sometimes I'll be doing it at odd hours. That I don't, I didn't do it every, I didn't do it at the same time every day. There were some times when I did it at 5 30 p.m. to 6 p.m. There were some times I did it from 8 30 p.m. to 9 p.m. And there were some times when I did it from 10 30 p.m. to 11 p.m. <laughs> And there were times when I've considered doing it outdoors, but where I live and the environment, outdoors is like not so convenient for me. I mean, when I say outdoors, I mean in the courtyard of my house or I have to go out, out. No, I'm not going to go through the stress of the cold and everything to just do this without a car. I, could, uh, I chose to do it either in my room, my bedroom or in the living room. So it was quite an experience and I mastered the dance, I mastered the songs. Hi guys, so this is day 7 since I started the workout, but this is technically day 6 because I missed one day as I may have already mentioned, but it's been a good workout. Look at me, I'm sweating. Jeez. Anyway, I'm going to take a quick shower and then hopefully I continue tomorrow. It's been good and I feel very, very great. See you guys tomorrow. Hi guys, so this is day 8 and I just finished with my 30 minutes workout routine. I'm sweating really, really good. And I'm going to take a shower. <laughs> See you tomorrow. Hi beautiful people. So today is day 9 since I started doing the regular workouts and all of that. So you can see today I'm looking a bit made up and all that. I just finished shooting some unrelated videos for my YouTube channel. You can do well to check it out. And I'm actually going to work out today with a full blown face of makeup and my big hair. I hope you enjoy it and I'll be back after the session. So so I'm finally done with the workout. I did 30 minutes as usual and this is the end of today's routine hopefully i'll see you guys tomorrow continuing tomorrow see you guys and i had a pretty good sweat and my makeup actually held on pretty good see ya. i could actually feel some difference one thing i noticed is that i used to have slight back pains and i attribute it to the nature of my job because i'm usually sitting down typing the most i'll do is to maybe walk to the kitchen eat some food go to the washroom come back sit down come back sit down you know 
sometimes I'm sitting at my desk, sometimes I'm sitting at the dining area, sometimes I'm sitting on my bed. So there's not much of activity in my life it's because I'm more of a sedentary worker. So one of the differences I noticed was that the slight back pains I used to have, I stopped, I stopped experiencing the back pains during the whole workout process. Like even till date, I haven't been working out for less than a week now. I haven't experienced those pains again. I also found an improvement in just my general well-being. I'm, I was much happier and much more active and it also gave me something to look forward to every single day. They gave me something every single day. I'm like, yes, time, I'm going to work out today. Even if I'm feeling lazy, even if it's past 9 p.m. Even I'm like, okay, I'm still going to work out today regardless of how far gone time is. I'm still going to work out and all of that. So it was quite an interesting experience. I enjoyed it. I'm so happy I've picked back I fit my workout routine back up and I hope to be consistent. If you watch the things I learned in 2020, remember I spoke about working out and procrastinating and how I kickstarted my working out, my home workout in May, no, was it May or March last year and how I just became lazy and then I'm looking forward to picking it up. So I'm glad I've picked it up and I'm going to try other challenges and I'll see how it goes. It was quite an experience, man. And there were some days when I was running out of breath. <laughs> I was angry with myself, asking myself, why? Why are you doing this to yourself? Like, couldn't breathe, you're running out of air. But it was good because I had some good sweat. I feel the sweat on my face. You know, it's winter, temperatures are around zero degrees Celsius, one degree minus four. I am so happy I'm able to sweat it out and I feel so good. Like my working is showing, okay? Guys, we made it. 14 days, 14 days, 30 minutes each day. Whew. And we're here today. Like I may have mentioned, I don't have a tape measure. <laughs> I don't have a tape measure, I don't have a weighing scale, and I didn't want that to discourage me from doing this challenge because definitely, even if I'm not able to check my stats, I know I'm much healthier. So I'm going to see if I can shoot some after videos of my tummy at the end of the day i noticed some very slight differences but even though you may not physically see a tremendous change like you see a clear before and after physically and within i feel much better i learned how to do a choreographed dance eh, give it give it you know i'm an armchair dancer you see right now i'm sitting down mm. eh, eh, eh. let me stand up it's two left legs okay so girl i learned how to do a hand workout it's a hand it was called a hand clap workout dance routine i know i've massacred the name but yes so it was quite a good experience and i'm looking forward to taking up different challenges and, and I'll, I'll document them as well if i do pick them up this basically has been my experience i hope you enjoyed it and if you're looking forward to do some workout something don't procrastinate girl just do it for yourself first of all okay so don't procrastinate just do it you can start with little small routines and then small small your body gets used to it and all of that stuff i'm just hoping that when i reinitiate another workout routine my body doesn't just have to go into that rewind process i'm going to continually do it even if it's not as vigorous as previous i'm just going to maintain the flow so that my body doesn't get into a sleep and restart process which is going to make me feel all the pains all over again i hope you enjoyed this brief session i hope you enjoyed everything i shared like it really means a lot to me if you did enjoy it kindly leave a thumbs up you can go further by subscribing and commenting as well i'll be glad to interact with you in the comments section and be good make wise decisions make wise choices and let go and let god see you next time on my next videos and you can watch all my other videos just about now Loading it, loading it.